So hello, welcome back to my channel. Let's do shop my sash. <laughs> What's going on upstairs? Okay, so eyeshadow. I'm going to do, I'm sticking with what I usually do, where I pick out a neutral palette as well as colorful palettes. So this is my newest palette, Marky Waters by Ladybug Glow. This was gifted to me by my friend Amanda. And I've been having a lot of fun with it. So I'd repress that. Say hello to Willie. Say hello, hello to Willie. <laughs> my little I just made that my cat and dog spot. Because I was like a hairless. So I'm going to put this in my shop, my stash, just for liners or different types of looks. I have a lot of fun with these shifty shades, whether again it's liner, inner corner, lid, outer corner, you name it. So I'm going to put that in my shop, my stash, as well as. I want to wear more color. It makes me so sad. It sucks. I'm also going to pull my Actius Luna palette. I'm going to give this some more love. And then I need to get a neutral palette. I know this is excessive, but this is me. Okay, so I'm going to pull my Spectre palette from Girl on Girls. Because there's lots of neutrals, as well as colorful, as well as liners, as well as black. This has neutrals. This has even like a cool tone, which I can just throw in my crease. For shimmer, because I just don't do one eyeshadow look. It's just not my thing. If it is for you, great. Oh my god, why is <laughs> the animal noises? Gold, neutrals, colors, easy looks, complicated looks, easy looks, more colorful looks. Yeah. So we're gonna pull those three for eyeshadows. I'm trying to switch it up. I like doing different looks and different color combinations. I'm also pulling my palette from my friend that is the owner of Lady of a Glow. These are ones that she's made for me. They don't, I mean, they have names, but I have not labeled them. I forget to do that and I forget their names. And then let's do alcohol, which my friend Amanda helped me repress some eyeshadows, which was awesome. Okay. What have we not used? Actually, you know what? We're going to use some good old faithful Bare Minerals Complexion Rescue Tinted Hydrating Gel Cream. I have gone through one of these before. I don't know where I might, I am with this. I think. I don't know. And so, yeah. And then setting spray. Some of these use for wetting my brush. Give her eyes to those. So, okay. And that one's like a facial spray, but wait, I think I am going to use the facial spray from Mario Badesco. It's the aloe, cucumber, and green tea. I haven't used this as a makeup spray in a while, so we're going to use that for brows. I just switch back and forth pretty much, but I'm going to go back to my NYX because I was using the Arches and Halos brow tin pen and I like both so I'm still trying to figure out what color I really really like if I like the dark brown or the neutral brown but anyway I like the brunette shade for the next one the espresso one is just too dark and then I'm gonna switch back to the NYX thick it and slick it I think I'm gonna I haven't used this one in a while this is from makeup revolution and it's their brow definer for liner I think I'm gonna try just black this week. So I'm gonna go back to the Makeup Revolution liner because there's it's double sided and there's a thin side and a fatter side. I always use a thinner side. That's just what I do. But yeah, this needs a black. And then for lips, I love this lip gloss that Amanda from Ladybug Glow made me. And the Actius Luna ones are really good too. A really pale, pale nude. If anyone wants to make that, that would be fantastic. Okay, so do liquid lipsticks first. I never really have time to do liquid lipsticks, even though I really want to. So I think I'm just gonna do. Mm, let's try to play this one a little bit more. This is from Ace Beauté. I think this is the only thing I've ever tried from Ace Beauté. This is their lip liquid lipstick in the shade Manifest. I don't know if everyone's is like that, like cracked. I like the packaging. I want to try their eyeshadows. I just haven't yet. So I think I am going to try a lip liner with it. I'm going to try the, I'm going to try the Goal Citizen liner with it from NYX. I love their lip liners. That's basically all I use. And then for mascara, I have been trying a couple of new mascaras out. Still my favorite. 
is Lash Princess from Essence, which I almost got the purple one at Target, but I didn't. I stayed strong, even though I did get this. I did get the Wet n Wild Big Papa. Bigger is better. I mean, I'm sorry. Can anyone not think of like, I like it when you come Big Papa. Sorry. I used this today. I'm not really a fan of it so far. It's just very, I mean, it's very lengthening. So this is very lengthening. I don't see actually any smudging, but and it does separate, but it's not very volumizing. So I think I'm going to actually, I will pair this with a volumizing mascara. We'll give you another chance. Maybe I will try with my S I will try with my essence lash princess. Oh, from Ulta, my green dot, the curl and volume. I still miss my purple one a lot. Eventually I will repurchase and I am going to put it with my, I'm not a fan of you. Sorry. Sorry. I will be putting you with my Love Lottie London Super Fake Mascara. These are like the only, well, some I can put on the lower lash line, but like basically these are the two I switched back and forth between. This one's like, okay. I mean, it's good if you just want a natural mascara, the Rimmel one. I mean, it's the only thing I've ever tried from Rimmel. <laughs> and then for lip balm and lip gloss, I'm gonna need to use, let's see, what have we not used in a while? We're gonna use actually let's use elf's this is their it's in the shade pinkies up it is their glossy lip stain let's use that concealer since i'm using the bare minerals complexion rescue foundation i'm gonna pair it with the concealer which i really really like so underrated and then we're gonna do rare beauty actually we're gonna do flower beauty color corrector and i am gonna use my green elf color corrector I'm going to redness from breakouts. And then for sunscreen, I'm going to use the Trader Joe's Daily Facial Sunscreen. This is really, really good. As you can tell, I've been using it. I like it. And then I used this today. Not a fan. It does not look like that. Like, I wish it did, but it's not. I had a fight with you today. <laughs> and then eyeshadow primer. I'm going to use up my sandbar eyeshadow primer. As you can tell, I really have been liking that. I did get another Milani eyeshadow primer because I'm almost done and I will not not have that in my life. Do waterline. Sorry, you can hear still in the background. Let's do Dear Midnight Blackest Night Eyeliner for tight lining. And then waterline. I'm going to do purple. LA Girl, of course, Shockwave and Vivid. And then also, I'm just trying to get free so I can buy new ones, <laughs> new shades. And then I'm going to put a nude. I'm going to do Star 69 from AF94. Let's do blushes, highlighters, and bronzers. And primers. Okay, primer. We are going to do, well, let's try to use this up. The Elf Power Grip Primer, which I really, really, really like a lot. I'm going through it. I'm proud of myself. And then for powder, I'm going to use my Wet n Wild Essence Primer Finish Powder, the 5-in-1. It's really good. I repressed it. I'm so happy. Amanda helped me with that as well. I just use, I just use alcohol, rubbing alcohol. I use, you know, alcohol, alcohol. And then Ladybug Glow Blush in the shade Peachy Kisses. Super pretty. Only thing is storing it. I usually store it here, but when I'm doing my shot, my stash, I store it up. I store, I store my stuff up here for shot my stash. And then for let's see if we have cream. I never have time to do cream blush, but I sometimes I do. So I think I am gonna do my. I think I'm going to do. I'm gonna pull my Gen C blush in the shade apricot i really really like this i want to try more from them but that is what i have right now and then another primer for just hydration i'm gonna do okay let's do lys think bright and glow hydrate serum i use this more as a primer like a, like a glowy primer and then for highlighter, I'm just going to do some e.l.f. 
So we're gonna do e.l.f. Halo Glow Liquid Filter. I say one. I'm gonna do my Doll 10 Captivating Contour Palette for bronzer. And then for cream bronzer, I'll use my Rare Beauty Power Boost bronzer because I'm almost done. Like then I can put that in my empty, which I need to film, but I don't have time right now. Powder highlighter. I'm just gonna use an eyeshadow probably from some palette. I don't know. That is it. Okay. So we have all of our products. So that is what I will be using this week. Let me know what's in your shop my stash and stay tuned for some looks. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. I really, really appreciate it. And comment if any of these are your favorite and please subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.